capital of the world, it's round two of the 1990 competition on Star Search with Ed McMahon. Tonight, the search continues for the best new stars of the year with last week's returning champions, junior vocalist Christopher Eason, male vocalist Gary Adkins, dance champion Street Legal, team vocalist champion Chad Mullins, comedy champion Chris Alpine, female vocalist champion Leslie Lewis, band champion Mad About Flag, and TV spokesmodel champion Bobby Brown. Stand by for tomorrow's stars tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, the star of Star Search, Ed McMahon! Wow. Thank you very much. Very nice welcome. Good evening. Welcome to Star Search 90. Standing by a bright new talent from Chicago, Miami, New Jersey, Texas, Pennsylvania, even Kalamazoo, Michigan. Let's begin with our top of the line junior vocalist. The champion is back with four wins in the plus column, confirmed for the semifinals. From Midwest City, Oklahoma, here is 12-year-old Christopher Eason. The challenger is a very talented 11-year-old. She studies ballet, tap, piano, jazz, even fashion modeling. Tonight, she's here to sing from Wichita Falls, Texas. Please say hello to Christine Ilarana. Since you went away, the blues walked in and made me if he stays away, oh, rock and shit, I'm gonna get me. All I do is pray the Lord above will let me walk in the sun, walk in the sun once more, oh, once talk with the juniors before the voting this is going to be a tough one now tell me who are your favorite singers well whitney houston anita baker stephen wonder and my favorite one is michael jackson i like michael jackson because he's an idol to me and is someone i can follow 
You can follow. Can you do the moonwalk yet? I'm trying. You're trying. Okay. And you've done everything. 11 years old and everything including fashion modeling. Tell me about that. Yes, um, fashion modeling is really fun. They don't really teach you how to do that. They say model um, naturally. Can you model naturally? All right. <laughs> Looks pretty good to me, I'll tell you. <laughs> that was wonderful. Thank you. You're both very talented. Let's see what the judges have to say for our junior performers. The champ, Christopher Easton, receives three and a quarter stars. His challenger, Christina Ilirana, receives three. We have a tie already. Three and a quarter stars. Both of you are tied. You know what that means? At the end of the hour, the audience will decide who goes on to next week's competition. This gentleman is already in the semifinals, but you have a chance to be in there too. We'll find out later on, okay? Good luck to both of you. Bye-bye. All right, stay right here and help me with my next line, all right? Here we go. The big challenge continues with the male vocalists and the dancers. This is the ultimate talent showcase. This is... Star Search 90. You got it. Sam Harris, Kenny James, and David Slater. Just a few male vocalists who have gone from star search to stardom. That's what it's all about. Tonight, our competitors hope to follow in their footsteps. Our male vocalist champion returns with one win from Tucker, Georgia. Welcome, Gary Adkins. <laughs> I always get that same old feeling all over again. Cause everything is feeling brand new, just like the very first time. The beginning of spring that made you sing, go blossoming everywhere. You had to be a special love in my life. My April love, April love I never knew the joys from love could delight me so Just to know I have someone Thank you, Gary. Challenging for the title is a talented young man who's been performing since he was 16 from Baltimore, Maryland, where he watches Star Search on WNUV-TV. He's singing a song he wrote. Here's Mike Cole. A look of warm scrolls across your face. I greet you with a warm embrace. This is how we used to be A special feeling that we lost in time Thought so far gone, so hard to find Still burns a flame inside my heart It tricks my mind now Confusion's all around me I keep thinking it'll be alright Am I fooling myself? I feel the things I did Thank you, Mike. Let's see what the judges have to say. They give champion Gary Adkins three and three quarter stars. Challenger Mike Cole receives two and three quarter stars. Okay, come on over here, champion. Gary. 
Congratulations. Nice job tonight. Tell us about your singing experiences. Well, I sing full time in Atlanta, Georgia, and Tucker, and I travel in and out of the city just doing full time entertainment work. That's how I support myself. How long have you been singing? Since age 12. Since age 12. You're doing a good job. We'll see you next week. Congratulations. Thank you. Now for a real eye opener the TV spokesmodel champion. She's a stunning young lady from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Tonight she wears a designer fashion by Karen Okada. Here's five time winner and confirmed semi finalist. Bobby Brown. Hi, Bobby. Welcome back to the Star Search stage. Now, we've learned a little bit about you over the weeks. You're already in the semifinals. Tell us about some of your recreational activities. Well, of course, I like doing girl things like going shopping and spending money, lots of it. Good. <laughs> and um, I like outdoor sports such as horseback riding and skiing. I basically like to have fun in whatever I do. Okay, you're having fun here with us, aren't you? Okay, let's see Bobby Brown right now in her latest fashion video on Star Search. Right here. You're as cold as ice. You're willing to sacrifice our love. You never take. Bobby, very nice. We'll meet your challenger at the end of the hour. What's coming up? Incredible dance teams from Southern California and Chicago and teen singers from Ohio and Florida. Plus the best new bands of the 90s on Star Search 90. Now the experts who always recognize good talent, our judges. Starring in the role of Larry, the sole spokesman for the zany trio of brothers on the hit CBS series Newhart in their eighth season. He was also featured in the acclaimed miniseries Lonesome Dove, as well as the feature films Blade Runner, Coal Miner's Daughter, and Raggedy Man, William Sanderson. <laughs> Vice President of the Agency for the Performing Arts, involving the careers of Martin Mull, Buster Poindexter, Will Schreiner, and Robert Klein, Danny Robinson. <laughs> Vice President for AR West Coast for Black Music Epic Records and their associated labels, whose artists include Luther Vandross, Tina Marie, Babyface, Sade, and superstar Michael Jackson. Cheryl Dickerson. <laughs> Former artist relations manager for Yamaha Corporation of America, currently president of the Buttleman Leopold Company, executive producer of the television special Soundcheck, welcome Doug Buttleman. Let's stir things up with the dancers. The champions bring one win with them tonight. They're a team from Southern California. How about a welcome back for Street Legal?
Thank you, Street Legal. The judges will vote on a scale of one to four, but first we have to bring out your challengers. They've been dancing up a storm in the Windy City for the past two years. Tonight, they take Hollywood and the nation by storm. Please welcome GG Dancers. Is it going to be the champs or the challengers? Let's see. Dance champion Street Legal receive three and a half stars. The challengers, GG Dancers, get three and a quarter stars. Street Legal. All right. Congratulations. You did it again. Now, what do the members of Street Legal aspire to do with their lives? Oh, that's a toughie, but I'm looking into directing. Directing, and you? Uh, just to be happy. Be happy. I want to be a homeowner. Yeah. <laughs> Producing. Producing. Well, like Ed, I want to be able to pay my rent like next month. Next month, or win that $100,000, and you got it. We'll see you next week. Congratulations. Bobby. On Star Search, the round two semifinalists will meet the round one winners in a million and a half dollar finals. Coming up, the comics, female vocalists, and the best new bands of the 90s from Toronto to Minneapolis. I wouldn't miss it. This year, our talent scouts have turned out some terrific teen singers. And tonight is no exception. The returning champ has earned three wins. He knows that that record could earn him a place in the $20,000 teen finals. So without any further ado, let's say hello to 16-year-old, 6-foot-5-inch, Chad Mullins. <laughs> That flush on your cheeks is more than the wine And he must do something that I didn't do Whatever he's doing, it looks good on you from the challenger in her hometown of golden gate florida she seems to be more popular than orange juice ladies and gentlemen a warm welcome to 14 year old kerry ann moore
Thank you, Terry Ann. Now let's see what the judges have in mind. Champion Chad Mullins receives three and a half stars. Challenger Curry Ann Moore gets three stars. Chad Mullins. Congratulations once again, Chad. Now what does your father do? He's a truck driver for United Parcel Service. And how tall is he? 6'1". Six 6'1". One. Six one. How about your mom? She's uh, real short. I guess she's probably about 5'3". <laughs> really? In my family, yeah. Well, that's, that's amazing. Yeah. You're 6'5". Yeah. Well, I'll bet they're very happy tonight, because just what? You're in the semifinals. Congratulations, Chad. Okay, pal. We'll see you next week. Bye-bye. Nice job. It's comedy tonight, next on Star Search 90. Now, something exciting, something delighting, something for everyone. It's Comedians Tonight. First up is the champion. He's returning with one win to his credit. He's from Seattle, Washington. His name is Chris Alpine. Hello. Uh, I had my car stereo stolen this week. I didn't even know it was gone until I hopped in my car, strapped myself down with my seatbelt, revved the engine, went to slap a tape, and that's when I found out my tape deck wasn't there. My arm went right through that hole in the dashboard. It's like, wow! So I called the cops. They sent me a tip sheet on how to prevent crime in my neighborhood. Like, just having this is going to make me feel safe. What am I supposed to do with this if I see a couple of crooks breaking into my car? Wave this at them? Hey, get away from that car! <laughs> but see, we think we're such great drivers on the West Coast, but we have no clue as to how to drive in snow. We, see, we get a quarter of an inch of snow, we shut down. Oh, can't get in today, boss. No way. We got drifts out here half an inch high. Oh, yeah. We see whites up on the road, we all become like Gomer Pyle. <gasps> Shazam! How do I stop? And somebody always says, oh, hit the brakes extra hard, because it's real slippery out there. <gasps> yeah! No, oh, keep your foot off the brakes. Get in a slow lane. The guys that I hate are the hot rodders, the ones with the jacked up Pontiacs, wooden speakers in the back window, because you just can't get guns and roses loud enough. No, 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 no. <laughs> These guys zoom by me at 70 miles an hour throwing snow on my car. Does that bother me? No. What bothers me is the look they give me when they go by, like, I'm the problem here? They give you this. <laughs> There's nothing you can do about it. They're going 70, you're going 12. Don't worry, you get your revenge. 10, 15 miles up the road, there they are, upside down in the middle of a snowbank, crawling out. Now, of course, they're your big buddy. <laughs> <laughs> I never stop and help these guys, but I love to slow down and rubberneck. Stick my head out as far as I can, then buck my teeth. <laughs> and then ask that stupid question, what happened? And they'll tell you, well, the car went in the ditch. Well, okay. Thank you very much. Thank you, Chris. Now, your challenger previously worked in a dog food factory in New York. Of course, he eventually realized he was barking up the wrong tree. I'm sorry about that, friends. From San Diego, California, say hello to Mark Brazil. Hi. Thanks very much. My name is Mark Brazil. I'm originally from New York, so I'm not afraid of you. Thank you. Well, I drove here tonight, uh, and let's just get right to it. Cops are jerks, aren't they, pretty much? Would you all agree with that? I Got pulled over and cops, you know, they always ask you that same stupid question, you know, it's like, you have any idea how fast you're going? Uh, yeah, same speed as you when you pulled me over, Kojak. I don't know what the big mystery is, huh? <laughs> I don't like these meter people, that's the worst kind of cop, you know, the cops are too psychotic to get a big car and a gun, so they give them like a golf cart, a pad, and a pen, they go, here, go annoy people, Barney Fife, that's your job, you know? <laughs> that's all they got, they got like a golf cart. This is really fun, though, if you want to humiliate them, next time you see them, just pull up next to them and go, hi, how you doing? Listen, I'd like a fudge sickle. My friend will have a nutty buddy, please, if you got a minute there, Mr. Push -up. Can't stand that. Well, I'm 27 years old. Uh, it's an awkward age. It's that age where you get wrinkles and pimples. I'm not real happy about that. Uh, go to the grocery store, I have to buy Retin-A and Clearasil. It's kind of a drag. Uh, just broke up with a girl I'd gone out with for about three years, and uh, save your pity, you might be able to relate to this. Have you ever ended a three-year relationship and thought, well, there's a one-night stand that went way too far, really? Uh, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. We just, uh, we had a difference of opinion. She really, really wanted to have kids badly. She wanted kids. I remember I used to go over to her house. She'd have, like, empty picture frames scattered all around, you know? And that was, uh, 
Well, she had a dog. She had a, well, I wouldn't say it's a dog. It was a poodle, which is, you know, a poodle's not really a dog. A poodle is just like a cat with a perm. And who needs that? You know, really, I, uh, you know. We just, we, a lot of differences of opinion. I, uh, let's see, we have George Bush, our new president. I like George Bush. I thought, uh, I thought he was good. I, it kind of scared me when George Bush picked Dan Quayle, though. That kind of, that kind of frightened me. Because with Dan Quayle as vice president, you realize we're like one breath away from President Rain Man, pretty much. Uh, you know, it's, <laughs> Think about it. It's like, what's the budget deficit, Dan? Oh, $246 trillion, $817,000, 12 cents, you know? What's a, what's a, thank you. It's like, what's, what's a B1 bomber cost, Dan? About, about, a, about $100, about $100. Don't have, don't have any underwear on, George. You guys are a lot of fun. Thanks very much. Thank you, Mark. Let's check the judges and see who it will be tonight. They give champion Chris Alpine. Three stars. His challenger, Mark Brazil, receives four stars. Mark Brazil. Good going, Mark. Boy, that's, that's kind of rare in the comedy division to get a perfect score, but you did. You mentioned being pulled over by a policeman. Did you ever really do a joke on a policeman? Uh, it wasn't really. Yeah, I did. It, was, it wasn't really a joke. It was in Downey and this... Uh, Cop pulled me over. He said, what do you do? I said, well, I'm a comedian. And he goes, really? Well, why don't you tell me a joke? And I said, well, you know, I'd love to, but I'm kind of in a hurry, as you notice, you know. And uh, it wasn't like a Zsa, Zsa thing, but I did just, you know, I was kind of rude to him. That's all. <laughs> okay. Well, we love you here. We'll see you next week. Thank you. Okay. Now, the elegant and eloquent spokesmodel challenger. Originally from Kalamazoo, Michigan, now living in Miami, Florida, wearing a fashion designed by Angaro Parallel, please welcome Joey Washma. <laughs> Hello, Joey. Welcome to Star Search. Boy, you certainly don't look like a Joey, I'll tell you that. <laughs> tell me about growing up in Kalamazoo, Michigan. Well, it's a small, cultured, pretty city. My family has been, my parents have been married for 43 years, and I think that says a lot about life and the way I was raised and brought up. I feel like a very down-to-earth person, although I do love the big cities. <laughs> you do love big cities, all right. You're in one right now. We're going to see your latest fashion for video right here on Star Search. Here's Joey. <laughs> the judge's decision soon. What's coming up next? The female vocalists and best bands for 1990 try to make their dreams come true on the Dream Maker Star Search 90. Next, the female vocalist competition. One will be victorious and possibly go on to the $100,000 finals. We'll start with the champion. She's going for her fifth win and is confirmed for the semifinals. From Van Nuys, California, welcome Leslie. Lewis. I was never impressed by people, never obsessed by people. I couldn't believe that someone stood above the rails. Oh, but I broke my every rule and I acted like a fool when I let your love get under my skin. Now I I have believed your every life Now I'm living in a dream I can't win Didn't you know you were my hero? My inspiration and the light to fill my day Didn't you know
Leslie, now the challenger. She could have remained a model, but she knew she had to sing. From Tuckahoe, New Jersey, here's Sheila Handley. Sheila, it's decision time for our female vocalists. The judges give champion Leslie Lewis three and a half stars. Her challenger, Sheila Handley, receives three stars. Leslie Lewis! Congratulations once again. It seems only natural you'd come from a family of musicians. Yes, I have a uh, talented and, and supportive family. My sister Jenny is a singer and also an actress, has an upcoming movie this year. My mom is a veteran singer who sang in clubs all over the country all of her life. My father had a hit record in 1968 with Hamilton, Joe, Frank, and Reynolds, Don't Pull Your Love Out On Me, Baby. And my mom told me tonight, this is your turn, and I guess it is. It is your turn, because we're going to see you next week, and we'll see you in the semifinals. Congratulations, darling. <laughs> Joey. Coming up, a little bit of country and a little bit of rock music with bands. This is Star Search 90, an American tradition. The band category has been back for five rocking weeks, and they put on quite a show. Their goal is $50,000 in the round two prize finals. Our champion are back with three wins. Now, from Toronto, Canada, singing an original song with lead vocals by Liz Soderberg, welcome Mad About Plaid.
Let's meet Mad About Plaid. On lead vocals, Liz Soderberg. On keyboards and vocals, Joe Alossery. On lead guitar and vocals, Brian Alossery. On bass, Eric Sustar. On percussion, Philip Hill. On vocals and saxophone, Ross Woolridge. And on drums and vocals, Brad Butcher. Thank you, Mad About Plaid. The band challenges come to us from Minneapolis, Minnesota, where they watch Star Search every week on WCCO TV. Welcome, High Noon. and acoustic guitar, Rick Aronson. On fiddle, Bruce Hoffman. On bass and vocals, Darren Thompson. On keyboards and vocals, Denny Johnson. And on drums and vocals, Mike Peterson. Thank you, High Noon. Okay, decision time. The judges give champions mad about plaid. Three stars, their challengers, High Noon, receive three and a quarter stars. Congratulations, Man About Plaid. You're going to be back with us. We'll see you next week. Congratulations, High Noon. Now it's the TV spokesmodel's turn. Judges, you've seen their fashion videos. We've talked with them. Who will come back next week? Current champion, Bobby Brown. <laughs> or challenger, Joey Borsma. The judges give Bobby Brown four stars. A perfect score. Joey Borsma receives three stars. Bobby Brown once again. Good luck to you. Bye-bye. All right, you've done it again. You're on a roll. Is that five, six wins now, right? Congratulations. Okay, stay right here. We're coming back with our tiebreakers and all of tonight's champions Right after this, the bright new stars are on... Star Search 90. Yeah! First, the tiebreaker, junior vocalist. Our studio audience has voted. It's either Christopher Eason in junior vocalist or Christine Ilarina. Let's find out what the audience says. A new champion, Christine Ilarina. There you are. Congratulations. We'll see you next week. And you're in the semifinals. We'll see you later on. Okay, nice job. That was tough. Bye. Well, right. That's it for tonight. There's more action and competition on the way to the finals and the big payoff. Let's meet all of tonight's champions one more time. Female vocalist champion in the semifinals, Leslie Lewis. Male vocalist champion, Gary Atkins. Team vocalist champion, Chad Mullins. 
New junior vocalist champion, Christine Delarina. Dance champion, Street Legal. New band champion, High Noon. New comedy champion, Mark Brazil. And in the semifinals, TV spokesmodel champion, Bobby Brown. Good night from Star Search 90, the world's greatest talent competition. If you would like to compete on Star Search, send an audio or videotape to Star Search 875 3rd Avenue, New York, New York, 10022.